Welcome to M Health and Info, your ultimate source for all things health and wellness. Join us as we explore the latest in medical science, debunk health myths, and provide expert insights to empower you on your health and wellness journey. Hit subscribe, ring the bell, and let's explore the world of well-being together. This is M Health and Info, where knowledge meets vitality. Navigating the dietary landscape during pregnancy can be both exciting and daunting for expectant mothers. The first trimester, a crucial period marked by the early stages of fetal development, necessitates careful attention to food choices to ensure the health and well-being of both mother and baby. During this critical time, certain foods should be approached with caution or avoided altogether to mitigate potential risks of foodborne illnesses, harmful bacteria, and toxins. Understanding these dietary considerations is paramount for expectant mothers as they embark on this transformative journey. In this guide, we explore the foods that pregnant women should avoid during the first trimester, offering insights to support informed decision-making and promote a healthy pregnancy. Raw or undercooked meat and poultry. Raw or undercooked meat and poultry can contain harmful bacteria such as salmonella, E. coli, and listeria monocytogenes, which can cause foodborne illnesses like salmonellosis. E. coli infection, and listeriosis. These bacteria can lead to symptoms such as nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, abdominal pain, fever, and in severe cases, complications like dehydration, miscarriage, or stillbirth. Cooking meat and poultry to the recommended internal temperature kills these bacteria, reducing the risk of foodborne illness. Pregnant women should ensure that all meat and poultry products are cooked thoroughly before consumption. Raw seafood. Raw seafood, including sushi, sashimi, oysters, and shellfish, may contain harmful pathogens such as Vibrio, norovirus, and parasites like anisakis. These pathogens can cause gastrointestinal infections, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, abdominal cramps, and dehydration. Some seafood, such as certain types of fish, may also contain high levels of mercury, which can harm the developing baby's nervous system and brain development. To reduce the risk of foodborne illness and exposure to mercury, Pregnant women should opt for fully cooked seafood and avoid high mercury fish. Unpasteurized dairy products. Unpasteurized dairy products, including milk, cheese, and yogurt, can contain harmful bacteria such as Listeria monocytogenes, E. coli, and Salmonella. Listeria infection during pregnancy can lead to miscarriage, stillbirth, premature delivery, or severe illness in the newborn. Pasteurization involves heating dairy products to kill harmful bacteria, making them safe for consumption during pregnancy. Pregnant women should choose pasteurized dairy products to minimize the risk of foodborne illness and ensure the safety of the developing baby. Soft cheeses. Soft cheeses like brie, camembert, feta, queso fresco, and blue cheese may contain listeria monocytogenes, a bacterium that can cause listeriosis. Listeriosis can lead to flu-like symptoms, including fever, muscle aches, and gastrointestinal symptoms, as well as more severe complications such as miscarriage, stillbirth, or neonatal sepsis. Heating soft cheeses until they are thoroughly melted and bubbly can help kill any listeria bacteria present, making them safe for consumption during pregnancy. Pregnant women should avoid consuming unpasteurized soft cheeses and opt for pasteurized varieties to minimize the risk of listeriosis. Raw eggs. Raw or undercooked eggs may contain a salmonella bacteria, which can cause food poisoning. Salmonella infection during pregnancy can lead to symptoms such as nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, abdominal cramps, fever, and dehydration posing risks to both the mother and the baby. Foods containing raw eggs, such as homemade Caesar dressing, mayonnaise, and cookie dough, should be avoided to reduce the risk of salmonella exposure. Pregnant women should ensure that eggs are thoroughly cooked until both the yolk and white are firm to reduce the risk of foodborne illness. Raw sprouts. Raw sprouts, including alfalfa, clover, radish, and mung bean sprouts, can harbor harmful bacteria such as E. coli, salmonella, and listeria. Sprouts are grown in warm and humid conditions providing an ideal environment for bacterial growth. Consuming raw sprouts increases the risk of foodborne illness, especially for pregnant women who are more susceptible to infections due to changes in their immune system. To reduce the risk of foodborne illness, pregnant women should opt for cooked sprouts or avoid them altogether during pregnancy. High mercury fish. Certain types of fish, such as shark, swordfish, king mackerel, and tilefish, contain high levels of mercury a toxic metal that can harm the developing nervous system of the fetus. Mercury exposure during pregnancy can lead to cognitive and developmental delays, learning disabilities, and other neurological problems in the baby. Pregnant women should avoid high mercury fish and opt for low mercury alternatives such as salmon, shrimp, canned light tuna, and catfish. 
It's essential to consume a variety of fish that are low in mercury to benefit from their omega-3 fatty acids, which support the baby's brain and eye development. Caffeine. While moderate caffeine intake is generally considered safe during pregnancy, excessive caffeine consumption should be avoided. High caffeine intake during pregnancy has been associated with an increased risk of miscarriage, low birth weight, and other adverse outcomes. Pregnant women should limit their caffeine intake to no more than 200 milligrams per day, which is roughly equivalent to one 12-ounce cup of coffee. It's essential to be mindful of hidden sources of caffeine, such as tea, chocolate, energy drinks, and some medications, and to monitor overall caffeine intake during pregnancy. Alcohol. Alcohol consumption during pregnancy can have serious consequences for the developing baby, leading to fetal alcohol spectrum disorders, FASDs, that can cause lifelong physical, behavioral, and cognitive impairments. There is no known safe level of alcohol consumption during pregnancy, and even small amounts of alcohol can pose risks to the baby's health. Pregnant women should abstain from alcohol entirely throughout pregnancy to prevent FASDs and ensure the best possible outcome for their baby's health and development. If struggling with alcohol dependence or finding it challenging to abstain, pregnant women should seek support from healthcare providers and resources available for substance abuse treatment. Unwashed fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables may be contaminated with bacteria, parasites, or pesticides, posing risks to pregnant women and their developing babies. Washing fruits and vegetables thoroughly under running water can help remove dirt, bacteria, and pesticide residues from the surface. Scrubbing firm produce like apples, cucumbers, and potatoes with a brush can further reduce the risk of contamination. It's essential to store and handle fruits and vegetables properly to prevent cross-contamination with raw meat, poultry, or seafood, which can harbor harmful bacteria. As the first trimester of pregnancy unfolds, dietary choices play a pivotal role in nurturing the growing life within. By heeding the advice outlined in this guide and avoiding foods that pose potential risks, Expectant mothers can cultivate an environment conducive to optimal fetal development and maternal well-being. As always, consulting with healthcare professionals for personalized guidance remains paramount throughout the journey of pregnancy. With careful attention to dietary considerations and a commitment to nurturing oneself and one's baby, expectant mothers can embark on this remarkable journey with confidence, laying the foundation for a healthy and fulfilling pregnancy.